Hey, this is Mike Hines, and for this art and design tutorial, I'm going to show you how to use gradient maps in Affinity Photo for iPad. I'm going to go into the illustration of mine. Okay, I want to add an adjustment. We just click the adjustments tab on the right. Just going to click that. That'll bring up the adjustments panel. You can scroll down to the gradients map and you click on the gradients map, and that'll apply rainbow gradient which you can start changing by tapping into the color and adjusting adjusting the parameters with these sliders and you can just begin to adjust your tones with this gradient you can also adjust the the position of each tone on the gradient with one of the uh, colors selected you can add another color to your gradient and then adjust it. Um, this is a horrible gradient. I want to go into this red channel and just make that a little bit darker. Okay, so now we have our first gradient. I want to save this gradient, so I just hit the plus sign down here. And now I can name my gradient and I'll say uh, Munashe. Okay, now I have this gradient saved. If I didn't like the gradient and I wanted to get out of it, I can just say trash. And that will take me back to my original photo. If I want to go back to my saved gradient and uh, add it back to my illustrations, I can go to the adjustment options until I get to gradient map. If I scroll down, I'll see the new gradient that I just created, Munashe. And if I click that, it'll add it to my illustration. I hope you liked this tutorial. And if you, uh, if you enjoyed the tutorial and you wanna see more tutorials like this, give this video a thumbs up and I'll see you in the next one. Thank you, bye.